Hi guys, one year ago I started my famous walk, you know, where I stayed for three months in the mountain with my not so professional as you can see bag and not so professional sticks and not so professional shoes of course. But it worked of course because I had the intention to do it and I would sleep in the creepy places like like this, churches, with a sleeping bag. It was very rough. But you know, I really like that kind of life, you know, I went in this refuge and I stayed alive thanks to the chestnuts that I would, you know, they would keep me alive, you know, the chestnuts, guys, it's this thing here. There was, of course, George, guys, it, if it wasn't for George, even though he, he, um, we are talking about zombies, guys, but um, he, he was a bit, um, a, a good zombie, somehow, and, uh, and he helped me, he was the reason the other reptilians there kept me there as you can see this other reptilian is a little bit less less good this other one but but you know i will get mad with these people guys and, uh, and with john especially but you know because i thought they were humans back then how oh, had how crazy i was you know here here is a chestnut guys i would cook them so the, the worms would not eat them before me keeping me alive so I would cut wood there this is where I live guys in a, in a building made of stones like this and it was hard for me to take wood and everything and uh, to, to upload my videos I would go and make 60 kilometers up and down the mountain to get to this beautiful 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 uh, sheeple stand sheeple's uh, holder called Passoas Lusania and it was hard and painful but I had to do it it was the only way to keep me alive guys I'm a, I'm a spiritual guy so internet and the ideas you know things that you cannot touch really feel me uh, can I please uh, take this off thanks and so um, uh, this was life in the mountain, guys. You would do wood like you should. You know? And as you can see here, my bag also is filled with wood here, guys. I'm filled with wood. Very nice. And this was the place where I would sleep, guys, as you can see. I had my computer there, as you can see, Mac Mini. And, uh, and our shoes here. And, uh, and the place was very cold, guys was a mess but you know what was important for me was the freedom that I thought I would have in in, uh, in such a lonely place but and, and I thought you know I would use photography you know my skills in photography to unite this community there you know these people that would come there these walkers walkers and uh, but and this was Lotsley guys it was basically this church in the middle of nowhere with uh, this other building here and there was another building smaller than this that it's not seen here in this picture but that was Lotsley guys and, uh, and here is me just you know, standing by the fire which uh, I, I would love to be able to do it again but uh, yeah since they are about to kill us, that's all I got to play with fire in my life for those three months. So and there was a, few, a couple of days that snowed there. It was very nice, you know, to have some snow. And here is why I'm, I'm talking about this because the, I was about to, to make a movie uh, there. I thought, you know, there is so much sheep that comes here, you know, I, I could use them as actors, you know, with my skills in photography and, and as a great director as I am, of course. I write, I wrote a script, you know, and I thought to myself, okay, I will use the sheep, you know, in a funny way, you know, to tell a story. And, uh, and, and the story was, you know, uh, here it is, guys, me talking with the sheep that comes there showing them 9-11 building 7 you know every time to all of them i will bore them to death 
and now they get the corona guys since they uh, didn't understood that uh, the importance of 9-11 they would tell me you know but what who cares about 9-11 leave us alone and, and here's the sheeple guys all bunched together before before the corona guys here's ihs guys oh lovely priest the reptilian priest i miss you don antonio and here's me very um embarrassed by, by that scene you know I, i'll just take a picture of him and, and and me and here's this picture is very it's just you know what uh, what i was writing in the script in that movie i thought i will call this this movie kill bill and uh, and i would be bill and why uh, 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 someone would kill bill me bill now I realize you know Kill Bill is also connected with Bill Gates but anyway the the thing was this since I was seeing there you know since I've, I've never told the story of the script of the movie I want to make it public so you know just so since uh, I showed 9-11 and, and I talk about 5G and everything to the sheeple and they never cared you know when they came there I would always show them 9-11, Building 7, and they were always bored to death, you know? And so I thought to myself, I will make a movie with uh, using the sheeple on the uh, on the eve of uh, 31, you know, the last day of the year, they come here to, to eat like pigs, you know? And I would tell them, Could you, I wrote the script, you just have to do some parts that I wrote. Could you please do it for me? And I would do this thing, I, this came to my mind. Since I realized uh, that the sheeple didn't care about 9-11 and I was boring them, I thought I would make a movie just about this. So they, in, in this movie, the sheeple would kill me, guys. There would be like two sides of me, two sides either of the movie. In one side, the, uh, they would come in this lonely place in Lotsula, you know, the sheeple in this uh, very icy area, guys. Here's the Shiva, guys. The Shiva thinking, thinking that they are in control. They are control the world, as they say them in this BS, you know, New Age stuff. You know, you can control the world. You can be in control. Yeah, damn Shiva. Yeah, wear the mask, damn Shiva. It's so much better to talk with the animals, guys. And so here is a dumb sheep. They look human, guys, but they are dumb, dumb, dumb guys. Dumb. I imagine this guy, you know. I thought I would do a movie about the, the, the old sheep who live in there that used to live in lots of guys. But I imagine this 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 guy now is afraid of the virus. And so here was a crowd, guys, with the people that I wanted to do this uh, this movie. And I this was the 31 guys, the day they were eating like pigs. I went down, and since I knew they would not do the movie with me. And if before they said yes, yes, we will do the movie with you, and then they didn't accept that, and so I went down. You know, they were singing and, and eating like pigs, and I told them, let's stop this BS songs. You know, there were all these songs, famous songs about about their heroes, you know, the, the, the um, you know these music uh, singers of the 70s and 80s Italian music. Oh, so stupid, guys. And I thought to myself, well, I will go to them and I will just tell them, well, stop with this boring music, you dumbass. You know? And I did it. It's in the movie also. And so here's other dumb sheep that I'm showing in 9-11. They are all bored to death. You know, for a little while they would watch the screen, but then they would get bored. Telling me, you know, but 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 him like this one here. But, but, but I can do whatever I want. Yeah, yeah. Wear the mask, you dumb sheep. Oh, wear the mask. So this was plan. The the sheep will come in here. Uh, they would find one side of me in the uh, first half of the movie. They will find a boring guy, you know, like me, that bores them about 9/11 and stuff. And on the other half of the movie they will find a nice guy that doesn't bother them and but at the end they will pay the consequences of of, uh, of you know of the on the first half they found the boring guy 
they would be at least you know someone would uh, tell them about would warn them you know and so the future would be positive for them but on the other side when they uh, uh, took on the other on the other uh, version of the movie where the guy just you know kept everything for himself you know just be nice to the sheeple the future was nasty guys uh, so so that, that that's all guys I, I just wanted to show you the, to tell publicly what the script was of uh, Kill Bill the movie <laughs> that I was planning to do there. This was uh, Palazzuolo guys, where I would go uh, to, to just to connect online guys to upload my videos, which was very very hard because the connection was very slow. But it was it was beautiful, the snow and nature and uh, those few days that you know, and the whole walk now that I think about it, you know. Here's where I was uh, washing myself in the in nature, in the mountain, uh, the waterfall. Beautiful. Uh, people uh, were friendly with me, would give me uh, food, you know. This guy was giving me uh, tomatoes from his garden. This other guy here just gave me this fancy, his fancy home for free, like just like that. And I was just amazing. <laughs> here I was feeling spring water here I was walking in the edge of the mountain it was very creepy and uh, there was time that I slept in the, in the chairs like this it was very you know, I, well, I didn't sleep at all and here is the, the before corona guys here in Italy they tried to move the sheeple with the excuse of earthquakes they would cause earthquakes you know and move the sheeple as I showed in this Walk, guys, but now they had they, they saw that with uh, we can you can move the sheep with the corona guys, and so they do not need to do this anymore. And, and in fact, that there are no earthquakes anymore. And this one, I, I just want to close with this, guys. Uh, this was important, guys, because in one of these towns in the mountain, guys, that had this earthquake destroy them everything, a mayor had placed a propaganda like a uh, horse woman backs of woman and especially migrants woman so the sheep the italian sheep would be programmed to accept the immigrants that are flowing like crazy here in italy and destroy them this is propaganda guys but again i thought i was talking to thinking uh, individuals but so here's where i slept in a, you know rv how do you call it? like a car you know a house with a wheel you know? and here I, I really like this picture while I was walking you know, I saw this this dumb sheep oh yes with with their dog getting angry at me because I was watching the sheep it's exactly what we're dealing with guys they will be tattooed they will be chipped and you know I would get mad with people like this guys with this expression thinking they were human yeah. This is with who we are dealing with, guys. And all the the truthers, YouTubers, that still waste their time talking to the dumb sheep like like uh, they, they are human. After you know, you realize that they are putting the mask, guys, and they are not using their brain. It's over, guys. Just don't be a pussy. Just do what you have to do. And don't wait. Just go and talk with animals. <laughs> They are much better than sheep, guys. I would make fun with people that had animals before, but now I realize, you know, it's so much better to talk with the animals. And you know, I, I would, as I've said, I would get mad with the sheep, guys, because you know I would never expect uh, uh, things to to go like this.
contract taste contact tasting t- testing tracing forgive me contact contract contact tracing <laughs> Can I stop you? Did, did, yeah. No. Contact, taste, contact, testing. Uh.